so it's the night before Easter. What do you call that? Easter Eve? I'm going to call it Resurrection Eve. Guess who's cooking? Mm-hmm. Guess who's cooking? So we've got pot. Look at that. Look at that. And that's ground beef. Well, it's going to be ground beef. Well-seasoned beef. And do you guys recognize that? You should recognize that. We've done this before. Don't act like y'all don't know. What's it called? ZD. 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 Yeah. It's called ZD. They reminded me that it's a new year, and I said I wasn't making it for the rest of the year. And that was in 2009, and this is 2010. I just don't have, you know, my little chef assistant this year, but we have to make do. And we got something in this pot here. See that pot there? I love that pot. You guys, any of you guys have that pot? That is a wonderful pot, isn't it? I just love it. I love me some of that pot right there. Okay, so what's in that pot? We say, what's in that pot? Soft. Ooh. Oh. Ah. It looks like. Could it be? Rack of, rack, rack of lamb? Could it be? Filet mignon? No. It could not be. So what is it? It's two pot roasts. Yeah. Double your pleasure. All those onions. See those chunky onions? And the gravy simmering around it. Yeah. Two of them. Yeah, because I know greedy folks. One is not as big as the other one. See that? That's a baby one. And that's a daddy one. Yeah. Okay. Let's get out of there. Yeah. Yeah. So we have... Um, yeah, ZD going on, and um, pot roast going on, and we're going to have some coconut rice and red beans, maybe, I guess, I, I assume so, and um, I don't know what our vegetables are, because I'm not making it, but uh, someone told me something about some broccoli, or broccoli and cauliflower, or maybe just a tossed salad, but I'm hoping for the broccoli, and we've got some, some mushrooms to make some sautéed mushrooms, and... Um, Sneak in some cobbler. Shh. Don't tell nobody. But really, I didn't come to do the food. I came to say Happy Resurrection Sunday. Yeah. You know, it's the third day that he rose, right? So that's what I came to wish you Happy Resurrection Day. And I hope that in this year, not just in this season, but I hope in this year that um, you've had some time to move some things or God has moved some things out of your way in your life. I hope you've had some time to reflect on your life and how much better it has been or how much better it can be or how much better it will be. Yeah. So I hope you get to resurrect some things, you know, some things that you put down inside of you that really is what makes the best of you. Some things you may have pushed to the side thinking, you know, maybe I shouldn't have and maybe you should have. Some things that are inside of you that need to be pulled up and brought to the forefront instead of hiding in the back, you know. Some things for you. Some things to better you. Some things to encourage you. Stuff like that. So, happy Easter. Happy Resurrection Sunday. God bless all of you. And it's Saturday night and I'm going to put this in now because you know me. I, I'll put it in next Easter. Love you guys. Thank you for coming by and looking at my videos. Thank you for hanging in there with me. Thank you for loving me or sharing your love with me. And thank you for receiving and accepting me for who I am and how I am. Bye-bye.